What is up everyone, this is MotoTurtles here and today I'm going to show you how to fix the unable to load library Steam Client 64.dll issue that you may be facing. So let's get right into this. So if you're facing this error, there's a few ways to fix this. I'm going to show you the two easiest ways to basically fix this. The first thing is it could be that this is a virus protection happening, essentially your Windows Defender or some form of security defender making this being blocked. So the best thing to do is basically open up virus and threats, go to protection history and essentially find this, go to actions and either like turn it on or find it or whatever it is like wherever you basically see the virus happening like you can go to allow threats to go for it find again back it's it'll basically back to protection history find it there and then allow it it'll tell you like that steam.dll's whatever is causing the issue the other thing is essentially uh this, this website is called dll-files.com it's probably one of the best ones you can find any dll file that you need the one that literally is giving you the error copy paste that find it and then just straight up download it right so whether it's this one the 64 whatever right once you have that the easiest thing you should do is open up a finder folder like this the easiest way is probably to go from steam itself but you're probably having it happen on a specific game right so you could either go from this pc local to c program files go to steam and then go into the game itself like whichever game is basically happening for you and either if it's happening on the steam itself you can put it over here if it's happening on a specific game you can go to steam apps or i forgot where the games are but you can basically find yeah i think it's steam games and basically find wherever the game itself is and then put it in the games folder itself the again it's easier to go into the games folder from i think steam itself i'm trying it's like somewhere here but like uh pretty much you could just go from there directly go into that find wherever the steam games are over there in there put the dll file so yeah that's basically it uh if you guys have a video please smash that guys and channel make sure to subscribe click that notification bell, and that motor out peace